All right, welcome everyone. We're Semblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we're here for Jujutsu Kaisen Season 2, Episode 10. 10. Gojo is sealed. Mm -hmm. Gojo isn't going anywhere, and we are yep. still left with um, a lot to deal with. Indeed. Hanami is the only one, really, that's... <laughs> Worse for wear out of this whole situation and, on the and enemy side. At the very least, Hanami is very worse for wear. But yeah, um, what is their <laughs> that, plan that's now? It. That's yeah. it. Yeah. Uh huh. We're, uh -huh. we're fucked. <laughs> this isn't a go joke. Kill me. Yeah. That mm -hmm. that that's that's how bad it is right now. That's yeah. how bad it is. That's right. Um, we have Mojito here with all these people too. Mm -hmm. Um, this is this is a a nightmare of the highest order. Yep. And now our big twist antagonist, the brain sama of ghetto, but not ghetto. Mm -hmm. And he's not even really the problem. No, he's just. It's going to be everything somebody. else. Yeah, he's just somebody. A thing happened, and now the world isn't safe anymore. Yep. And now, while they know, which is good, that, that is very good. Being passed along is, mm -hmm. is huge. Yeah. Cool. And they know. Uh huh. Do they run? Do they I don't panic? Know. I don't Do they know. call in like some kind of big shot, like special grade? Yep. What's her name? That one giga Valkyrie blonde chick? Maybe. <laughs> yeah. That's 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 it. That's, 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 that's basically that's, it. Yeah. That's, that's basically where we're at. So, mm -hmm. all right, y'all. Without further ado, let's get into this. <laughs> oh. Game. This over. is how the message got sent out. Dang. <laughs> wow. Oh, shit. Such soft, somber music. What the No fuck? way! Holy shit. Just hearing Gojo say his name was enough for yeah. him to... Or was that him taunting him to give him hope? No, no. Well, Mahito's gonna start doing his thing. Yep. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Do we have to get into that? <laughs> hmm. That's curious. Yeah, let's, <laughs> let's keep it going. Damn, it's a little eyeball six-sided dice, basically. Yep. It even literally has the eyes. Oh, yeah, with the numbers. Yeah. The Hillet D6 edition. Damn. All right. He's not even here. He's mobile. Yeah. They could, they could uh -huh. put him anywhere. Yeah. That pandemonium, y'all. Mm -hmm. Oh, fuck. Mm hmm. Right. Gotcha. Whoa. Okay. See, I thought I was just being a communicator. <laughs> Jesus. Yep. Smooth as fuck. Yep. <laughs> Wouldn't done be a fucking up this bad. Also an excellent cover. Uh, two. Let's hope so. 
そんな連中がうようよいるの今までどこで何してたんだ呪詛師は無視して先に進もうもう渋谷の状況は変わっているこちらの数段上手だ4枚止まりが降りている一般人を閉じ込めると、right. 道場のハドルを閉じ込めるとまで呪詛師を入れないとまり A と同じ一般人を閉じ込める sure yeah C の隣で塞がれているとすで、mm-hmm. に待機していた呪詛師たちは泊まりの内側では携帯は使えない補助監督ともつながらない oh shit oh shit What are the other locations? Alright. Okay. <laughs> so you pay me? Yeah. Yep, yep, right. That way it's a two on two. I don't like dogs with hands. No, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> oh, hmm? <laughs> oh, shit! Wait! Well, never mind. No, it is staying here. <laughs> He's torturing it's crying. it. <laughs> He's like, all right. I believe in my students. Even when he's been overpowered, he still doesn't like go try hard. No. I mean, it's probably everything he's doing just to do that. Okay. <laughs> You go. Still gotta move fast. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Shit. Oh. All right, Beautiful. all right. I love that point when the protagonist reaches that peak level of physicality where we can just throw in a bunch of the regular no names and. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh shit, yeah! <laughs> This is amazing. <laughs> yep, go, go, right. go. Fuck! <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, 
Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> uh -huh. Hey, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can yeah. play on it too, uh -huh. so. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh Right, so we don't care. Mm -hmm. Why is Jogo the one that I'm most sympathetic with? Okay. Oh, shit. そう、そう、参加する。ベトは Oh. These two. Wow. Gotcha. Yeah, I can imagine. <laughs> yeah, <laughs><笑> Be the last time we see you. I mean, at this point, everybody's on the table. Oh, yeah. Really. My name is. Yeah. <laughs> Influence pride and wins. Mm -hmm. Yeah. うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。う
in the nature of a curse, a curse is just basically a projection of a soul. Mm -hmm. um, so then a person has a soul that could theoretically be damaged, but also their body, if they lose their body, they'll die. Right, because if there's any concept of a soul, then it's like, okay, so you're not just talking about right. your brain. Right, you know? but that means that, that Suguru's body is not only just alive because it's not, a, you know, you know, it's not falling apart. Right. But it's the, yes, if there's mm -hmm. anything in there that's, you yep. know, not a part of the brain piloting it. Mm hmm That's so epic, too, because then you could literally have Jujutsu Society saved by Ghetto. Sure. Oh, so here's, uh... Oh my god, okay. Fuck these people. Okay. Opportunists. Yeah. Okay, why did the well, box drop like that? Because he's fucking Gojo Satoru. Yep. I, oh I my god, it. that was yeah. such a cool, like, hey, yes, you sealed him, but he's still fucking with you because right. this thing is still, like... You know, completing. You know, the video has been uploaded to YouTube, but now it's processing. You know, yeah, it's, 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 it's it's rendering. It's rendering forever. out from some HD footage, but until mm -hmm. then, it's a 360p, 240p thing, just taking its time. And yeah. boom, <laughs> it's the just, data processor is too much. It's not moving. And <laughs> yeah. and Mechamaru's little backup thing. He had one of the things in there, mm -hmm. and it saw it. Cool. Right. So so, because, so now they know that Gojo yeah. is is there. Yeah, so because Mekamaru was having his kind of double cross deal set up with mm -hmm. Ghetto, we're just gonna call him uh, you know, yeah, Ghetto, Ghetto for now. For now. Mm -hmm. But um that is going to lead to them actually having enough information probably to maybe and this is the scary thing, they might not be able to get the box, but they might be able to claim this territory. Because I think what's gonna mm. happen is okay. that Gojo can't know what's going on out there, so he right. can't let you know, if, if yeah. Yuji Grazi goes, Gojo! You yeah. know, it's not going right. to work. Yeah. It's going to be, no, it's stuck here. Mm -hmm. Everyone's going to know always where Gojo is. And now we could get, oh man, oh, that could be so cool. Mm -hmm. We could get a battle shown in King of the Hill. Right, right. Where I think it's that's the, exactly what we're where getting. Where it's the defend this territory and it can go in and out of people's control and stuff like that. Well, that's why we're getting a Chimera Antark style narrator about where uh -huh. people are and yeah, who's yeah. going where and all that. And the different allegiances that people have and don't have, you right, know? Right, like the Because the, every person here in this final frame here are going to do something impactful. Right. That's why they were given this big frame here, especially all the way down to the two girls that Ghetto... Uh -huh. uh, Saved right uh, back then, then, and then basically his devotee, his, his the most devoted of devotees, who now yes, it was a big question kind of mm -hmm. in the back of my mind. Yeah, there was all these people that've been following Ghetto. So what would happen to? Oh, yeah. right. So uh -huh. all the curses and stuff. They yeah, they they don't really care. Nope. This is what they wanted. But, but for the humans, yeah, people that are like mm -hmm. you know in this from before, they're like, no, you betrayed us. Right. And we're going to make you regret doing mm -hmm. this. Now, obviously, this faux ghetto here is uh, definitely a bigger bad than just this arc. But there is a possibility. There is a possibility that since ghetto can at the very least mm -hmm. move a little bit in there, yep. we could get a situation where we have both ghetto and Gojo locking themselves in one place. Yeah. For just the purpose of, mm -hmm. you know helping out everybody else. Yep. And I would love to see this squiggly little intellect devourer piece Brain of shit thing. thing have to abandon the king of the hill status to be like, yeah. okay, yeah, 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 we won and Gojo's sealed, but we'll have to continue the war mm -hmm. elsewhere after all the carnage is, you know, settled and the dust is, you know, settled right. and all that. And but given that there's going to be a bunch of people that die probably in this arc. Oh, definitely. You could absolutely have something where he switches bodies mm -hmm. and then maybe takes over someone else. And then Yes, that is that know. is a very real possibility. There's there's a lot of people here that are not at that like complete plot armor kind mm -hmm. of status, but I think also just the fact that Gojo is sealed, mm -hmm. we now know what that means not just from the immediate character reaction kind of perspective, but we know Right, Gojo had a lot of people in Jujutsu Society that did not like him. 
and not just didn't uh-huh. like him, couldn't do anything about the fact that they didn't like him. Right. They won here. And and, the and they're things... going to pull some shit. Right. So things the... are going to get worse yeah. outside of here. I love that they brought up the idea that, hey, Yuji, you think you're the only one who's in this situation because Gojo exists and can basically mm-hmm. say, hey, one, if I decide to do something, you can't stop me. But two... I am your ultimate ace in the hole to say, hey, these potentially dangerous people, people yeah. they're not problematic because I can just kill them whenever, right? I'm that yeah. powerful. Yuji oh, now might just gone. be the worst example of that, but yeah. we don't know that he is. Nope. It's mostly just because he's been gathering fingers and Sukuna is Sukuna, mm-hmm. but really, it's only really bad if Sukuna just gets a ton of fin- and, uh, fingers. And the idea that Jogo is like, no, I don't. I'm not on board with this particularly either with regards to Yuji because I want Sukuna to come back. Right. And I so, want the Age of Curses for the world. I don't right. want just a big revolution in Japan until the world kind of goes, yeah, we got to stop this here. Right. And so now we could get a situation where in multiple different ways, both from Jogo and from the two girls, we could have antagonists helping the pro- protagonists in different ways. Mm-hmm. Because like, if he just shows up and he's like, hey, uh, Yuji, here's eight fingers. You know, right? Like that. That'd be that'd be nuts. Yeah. But yeah, yeah. I I am I am very excited for this to now be the proper kind of start of the the like the second phase, if you will, of this arc. Because mm-hmm. I feel like the first phase is now just everything that was pre Gojo sealing. That's uh-huh. that's that's. That was set up for all the shit that's that's going to happen now. Now act two happens where everything goes to shit. It's crazy. We've got powerful and not so powerful people on the antagonist side. Mm -hmm. We also have pretty strong people on the protagonist side. And a lot of people where it's like, no, you need to make sure you never bump into Jogo or Mahito, for instance. Like, Like those two, those two... While Chozo is definitely like a bit of a wild card, we don't mm-hmm. really know how strong he could be. I don't think he would handle Fushiguro and Nobara like black flashing his ass. Yeah, I, I think I think that's fine. It's really Mahito and Jogo who are kind of the, the okay, because balls. they're moving, mm-hmm. and whereas Geto is gonna stay here, which is actually like good. We uh-huh. we can kind of hold yeah. off on that. There are there are people that really just don't go anywhere near. Mahito or Jogo, or because it's just over, or anyone because hey, maybe you don't actually have powers. You just have a suit and a cell phone, and you've been helping. Yeah, yeah. Because that's the right thing to do. Yeah. And now you're fucking you're dead. dead. Like that. That was one of my favorite characters in all of Jujutsu Kaisen. He yep. had such a like, you know, thumb up his ass kind of like yeah. stiff kind of nature like, and stuff. But he's he, the he loved and cared these you know, for these guys. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like he, he, you know, because having yeah. a fucking rip. It's it's awesome to see someone who's super powerful being mm-hmm. you know being awesome right? right, but when you see somebody who doesn't have powers and they still you know fight the good fight and everything, it's like yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. I am really glad though that they have lots of different antagonists here mm-hmm. because I can see a lot of good two v one matchups here that make sense. Sure. But then we also just have the fact that Mahito has created tons. Mm-hmm. Of transfigured people oh, yeah. Oh, that yeah. can then end up becoming problems where yep. you could lock down some of these characters with just thirty of them. Like you, that'd be it. Yep. They're, okay, they're right. busy for a long time. Yeah, now. exactly. That might even be enough to kill them. Who's who knows? See what I what I want. We have this image of the different characters that are here, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. I want to see though particularly muscly guy in the OP <laughs> that is not shown here. Well, that's why Nanami getting out and mm-hmm. actually like, like doing invoking stuff. the, these are some of the things that first grades can actually do, but I know who to call yeah. Ghostbusters, you know, uh, and we're going right, to <laughs> right. we're gonna like, get them up in here. Like, and then it's going to be the, okay, now we have to hold out for 10 minutes or an hour mm-hmm. or whatever as reinforcements gets here. So the, some of the barriers get broken down Mm-hmm. And then at some point, Yuji, or or maybe they don't, I don't know. And then Yuji goes to do his shout from the top of a tower, you know, message thing. And then he hears back, my brother! <laughs> yeah. yeah. <sighs> um, but okay. But yeah, people hunting Yuji specifically for the, hey, our actual biggest problem right now is that Yuji has Sukuna. And if Sukuna ends up, like, working with him in some ways, like, 
Yuji is a problem. He's an X factor. So let's yeah. just let's, let's just kill him. him. Mm -hmm. I like that the antagonist disagreed on this factor. Yep, because... and they didn't actually fight each other over it. Well, well, yes, they didn't fight each other for it. But but the idea of Yuji being basically treated in the story from a meta standpoint as the antagonist going, well, let's just kill him. Mm -hmm. And because the protagonist is not the strongest character in the story, in fact, yep. he's not even one of the top like ten really. Right. Like, I mean, obviously he's done cool things, but it's the it's the moment where this builds real tension uh -huh. here. They just took out Gojo. There's no one they can't touch. Like Right. Yeah. And it's and it's obvious that while you have that hope of like, well, Gojo is a special case, we've got these items here, we've mm -hmm. got all and these they can't do that other again, things here. You know, yeah. that's, that's not gonna happen again. It is always the reminder, though, the reason that this show has such a such a real amount of dramatic tension with Yuji as the protagonist is because he is this bundle of goofy, idiotic joy, mm -hmm. and Sukuna is always with him, and at yeah. any point, Sukuna be like, it's my time. Right. I'm calling in the deal. Yeah, and one minute. That has yeah. been that has been hanging over the head of this anime ever the since that time. time. Oh yeah. And so yeah, at any yeah. point, uh -huh. at any point, Yuji and the OP kind of almost like almost like kind of spoiled it a little bit by being like, this is probably just gonna happen. Suddenly, just that Sukuna, yep. and it's uh -huh. like, yeah. There's oh, yeah. many points I can imagine where that would be the instant flip after the protagonist started to maybe come back on top ended up maybe playing the antagonist against each other, yep. or maybe just started a, a line of communication with reinforcements coming in and dealt with the uh, one with the purple uh, tear makeup. Right, uh, right. Stuff. Yeah, like I, I would not be surprised at all if let's say Jogo has some collection of like fingers that he's you know going to bring to Tsukunai or something. Well, they've collected some. That was Yeah, they, yeah right, they've one. collected yeah. quite a few. It could just be the, oh, if there would be something that would keep me from getting those, minute, boom. You know, I have them now. Maybe that would help you. Just maybe you wouldn't do it. But yeah, it, like there's there's a bunch of characters here that the show can kill off if they want to. I would be surprised if we didn't get at least five deaths in this arc. Yeah, like you know, Chozo, Chozo, yeah, Chogo, uh, and then uh, May May potentially. Yeah, I could see May May. I feel um, like we need at least two. Um, protagonists. I feel like as far as it. protagonists go, I don't want to like... You don't want to name any? I don't want to name any and jinx it, because it's this whole thing where I'm like, I'm looking at a specific set of five of them over there. Well, see, here's... Who okay. are like, I think, because I don't think Yuji... No. No, no, no. no. Of course but, not. But, but for Panda... I think for, it's... For Nanami... I think like, it's going to be uh, whatever his name is. You know. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Yeah. No, I counted him. Oh, okay. That was four. Oh, okay. I got to four with Eno Jacob. Yeah. All right. I'm well, telling you. Yeah. Like. Yeah. No. I. I 100% uh, think he's gonna die. Well. No. We have the uh, but... the 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 cop guy. Let me let me get mm -hmm. him here. Yeah. The cop I think would make sense to die. I feel like this is or where he though... looks like a cop, but he's... <laughs> or yeah, whatever his his deal is. Yeah, yeah. But I feel like this is the situation where we want one of the students to die. We right? want. Yes. I mean, Why? not we want, but like you know, in the story, right? Having a student die here. That, like, that would be the perfect follow-up on Ijichi dying. Bro, then it better be... Oh, man. Yeah, I know, right? It then then yeah. it kind of has to be Panda, right? <sighs> Maybe. I don't know. I really, Maybe. I really don't want it to be Maki. Okay, I feel okay. Like, Here's I feel a crazy like thought. of all the ones that I think that, like, can die from a meta standpoint, they did set up some potential things with, um, with Megami, mm -hmm. with Fushiguro. Um, I don't think he's gonna die because because it's the, you know main three, mm -hmm. and maybe this is me harping on a thing too much. I could also see Toto dying if he did show up. Oh fuck! Because Toto could absolutely die because he would absolutely go out in a blaze of glory. He would be the the cavalry's here, right? I mean, no, you know? he's not really the cavalry. He's, well, you know, he's just a student. From from depending on the scale that you're looking at, you know. Well, right, but, right, right. I I I I think that. I think that looking at this list here, mm -hmm. I think you're right that one of these characters is going to die at least. Panda, Maki, Megami, Nobara, Nanami. Yeah. One I would say Nanami five. Nanami has a has a high likelihood but Because he's an adult. Because he's an adult. And yeah. and yeah, but at the same time, the creator of JJK just got what they wanted. Gojo is out of the story and Nanami is, you know, is front and center, <laughs> right? Like 
But, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. I, I love that that's, like, a piece of trivia I know. That, like, the creator of the story, like, is not, like, the biggest fan of Gojo. Right, like, as and, a, and not as even subtle about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. And his favorite Fuck character is guy. Nanami. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yep. Or at least when we last had this info passed along to us, and that was probably oh. back in, like, season one. Oh, I fully believe JJK. that it stayed the same. <laughs> like, you don't you don't just move on from Nanami. But then if that's the case, you know, kill your darlings. Or kill their darlings. You know, that's what he did with Gojo. <laughs> you know, just, hey, and Gojo's you're... not dead. Gojo's, no, no, no. Gojo's in a box. Yep. Uh -huh. Gojo's in a six-sided die. Right. You know? Mm -hmm. He's role-playing in his head, you know? Oh, yeah. What, how everyone, like, is begging, no, please save Gojo! He's like, yeah. oh, no. I mean, yes, if you oh, must. Oh, like, that oh, would be terrible oh, if anything oh. happened to him. Yeah. <laughs> right. Gojo is so attractive. I love him so much. You uh -huh. must save him. Yes, gather all your strength together. Uh-huh. And then I'll break out. So Spider-Man, choose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll break out at the last second and be like, "Oh, mm -hmm. did you wait long for me?" Like yeah, I yeah, can exactly. totally imagine oh, him yes. absolutely drinking it up in there. In the floodgates in his, open, in and his, you know. right? But in the peaceful sleep that he's having for the first time in like forever, he's like, "Wow, nobody needs me right now." I mean, they need nice. me, but I can't. So no, no. I guess I'll just. What go are you to talking sleep? about? That that's nothing new. <laughs> no, that's the joke. Is yeah. that like he that actually gets is. to sleep through it fully? Mm. Because you know this season basically started with Gojo having a dream. You know why am I remembering this right now? And then he wakes up being like, oh, oh yeah, that's God. right. My dumbasses need me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So it's gonna be that, but it's gonna be at the end of the season, like at the very end of the season. Gojo will be like. So did you miss me? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, man. Disney princess waking up from, like, <laughs> enchanted slumber. Sleep. Yeah, uh-huh. <laughs> Tell me, did Yuji cry? Did Yuji, like, shed a few tears for me? It's like, well, he did. And then Megumi slapped him and, you know, yeah. he stopped crying. It's like, mm -hmm. god damn it. <laughs> um, I, I can't wait for the next episode. Yeah, it's I can't wait for the next so episode. I, I, want, uh, I want the reinforcements to be large and in charge. Mm -hmm. And I do want the Jujutsu Society drama to spill out to whoever yes. the fuck these other characters are coming in here. Uh -huh. um, so that yeah. we get conflicts that extend beyond this. Because I could see this wrapping up almost too quickly given mm. how few characters are are here that are right like, like there's a lot of characters shown in this one shot with the but die not and everybody all of them, but not all of them are really like high screen time characters. yeah exactly this is all things considered this is still a fraction of the cast yeah so i want to throw out there the idea mm -hmm. that like ghetto's body gets destroyed here and I, that's yeah. that's the loss that the villains get is that he well, that's why, want, that, yeah, that's why I want abandon ghettos. Yeah, that's why I want a brain swap because then you can get a situation where you can have a sort of Cylon type deal of, you know, mm. who a protagonist that's you know among us. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Among right. Us. Yeah. Well, we'll see. Yep. We'll see. Mm -hmm. Crazy, crazy development, and uh, yeah, let's bring everybody in. Mm -hmm. So, y'all, thank you so much for watching this episode's reaction and discussion. If you want to see the next episode's reaction and discussion right now, though, go check out the link in the description below for our Patreon. You can get an early access there. You can watch full-length timer reactions there, and all this comes with Discord access, so you can chat with us in the community there about this show, about anime in general, and also be sure to check out my Baldur's Gate 3 Let's Play on Twitch. And if any of that interests you, we'll see you there. But until then, we're Semblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we'll see you all next, next time. time.